I'm all I like. Keep the point going to my head, say, make God deny you. Thank you. Special time for feeling that I feel when I'm with you. Good morning. I'm beginning to begin to fall. I'd say we're just gonna do whatever we <laughs> wanna do. Yeah. If I just spend a lot of money on you, spend a couple of million on you, give you love until you say don't go. Yeah, yeah. Said that you moved on. Where did I go wrong? I tried to make you stay, but I guess my love. Was it real or just pretend? Tell me why do you wanna end? Was he really just a friend? No sign of you at all. Just pictures on these walls. I mean, remind me of how you. So coming to you from my brother's room. Oops. Okay. So future me here. Um, I just felt like I need to come on here and narrate this vlog because you won't understand what's going on. So at this point, my cousin and I had left Joburg and we had just gotten to Durban. It took like seven to eight hours, if I'm not mistaken. Um... So 78 hours traveled from Joburg to Durban and my dad picked us up and when we got home it was literally a thing of okay let's get settled in and um, we'll see everything tomorrow. So we got settled in, ate and all of that good stuff and then um, we slept. Um, for the duration of like December, I only got here around the 12th, 13th of December. So already i had like missed a couple of vlogmas days and i knew that i didn't want to do vlogmas because i wasn't going to be consistent and um i didn't want to put out anything that's just mediocre and something that i am not proud to put out there because i really do take time in editing and like um finding new ways to create and make my content better so yeah um we got here and then immediately i started work and because of work, I did not have time to vlog or to create content at all. I would always come back late. And then if I do come back early, I'm tired. Or if I'm taking a day off, I'm tired. So that was that. And I knew that that was going to be a factor that was going to play into this whole creating thing. So yeah, I just compiled this video of random things that I did over December and it's not even much. My holiday consisted of me watching late night shows, um, arguing with my siblings, uh, eating, sleeping and eating. So yeah, that's literally most of the things you're going to watch. And then came Christmas and on Christmas we just did an impromptu thing. So yeah, onto the vlog. <laughs> Okay, let's go. Your accent, but, but why are you butchering another person's name like that? 
<laughs> we were working yesterday so we couldn't really plan anything out but yeah today we're just gonna do whatever we want to do i did my nails <laughs> Point on to my head, say make I deny you I go tell them, say lie, lie Don't be lie, yeah I feel to spend all of my money on you Spend a couple, couple million on you Give your love until you say don't do, yeah, yeah Special type of feeling that I feel when I'm with you Won't do mommy anytime we are there with you I want your heart and soul and your own body too I can't let you go, I'm beginning to begin to fall in Pineapple stick. Spice, okay. Spiced, please. Thank you. Good morning. Like, everything that could be wrong with my hair right now is wrong. Like, period. I'm trying to decide if I want to go and blow out my hair. I had spoken to the lady yesterday and I asked her about like price and stuff and just the whole process of how she goes about washing natural hair and she she just said she was gonna give me like a normal wash and blow out my hair and for the price i did not think that was gonna be worth it whereas um i don't really know how she's gonna wash my hair like i'm very particular about how i want things done and because i haven't been to the salon and i've always washed my hair since i went natural and this is kind of like one of the first times i let someone touch my hair um at the salon i kind of want to know what she's gonna be doing so that i know if it's worth it or not but um it wasn't really giving me anything so i decided that i'm just going to wash my hair myself and then she's going to blow dry it and make it straight not straighten it but like straighten it with a blow dryer because yeah i want my hair straight so yeah that's what i'm trying to decide if i'm even gonna go but i just woke up looking a little crusty um my face has it's really been breaking out this december i don't know why um i have mosquito bites all over my arms but yeah <laughs> it's whatever
Chemistry was crazy from the kick-go Neither one of us knew why We didn't build nothing overnight cause So this is legit my hair After a blowout, I'm... I'm mad I really thought it was gonna straight It was gonna stay straight But... My hair decided to not do the thing, so it is what it is. Like, I don't know. As soon as I walked out, I knew that it was going to shrivel right back up. This was such a fail.